Hello guys and welcome to the first video that we're going to do for you for the rocket. What we're going to do here is we've got an old unit. Um, we've given it a lick of paint and we are going to do a little case study uh, a li little bit later on. We'll install it in our staff quarters but for now we're just going to set it up. We're going to light a fire and we'll be able to measure how long it takes for the water to get hot. We'll do things like install a safety valve which we recommend. Um, we're not going to put in a sacrificial anode, which we do supply and do suggest if you've got water quality problems. Um, and yeah, let's see what happens and we'll touch back with you in a bit. Cheers. Okay guys, so after a quick setup, um, hose pipe and tap we've got on there now. We've got a, some small wood pieces here that we've, we've got some garden refuse in the garden. Um, the last thing to do is we're going to install a safety valve, which like I mentioned, we uh, recommend for all installations. This is a rural setup. Um, the idea is also that you plumb it in line with the geyser, which is what we'll be doing a little bit later. Um, we're going to light the fire and we'll check back with you in 20 minutes. Okay, so a bit of fire here now, um, as we've got the tap on, um, we've put a little spark arrestor on here, um, which you can also buy for safety purposes, again, recommended. Uh, we've got the SABS approved safety valve, um, obviously for the gases um, and the pressure that's inside the unit. Uh, fire's been burning for about 10 minutes now. We're going to tap a little bit off and um, let's see how hot it is. How is it? It's hot. Heard it from the man himself. It's hot. Cheers, guys.